Yes, get ready for it. It's coming all things May. You're taking a live look now uh, over at IMS, the Indianapolis Motor Speedway. The sun is shining. It's just a beautiful day outside. Uh, lots of events happening, uh, you know, today, tomorrow, this weekend. Yep. Uh, one event is, is evident by oh, yes. the jersey Sean is wearing. First Can time you tell? in 10 years we've <laughs> yes. had racers and pacers. Yep. May 15th, 2014. Mm. Last time the city hosted a game six. Last time the pacers mm -hmm. won a playoff series. Nice. Can you? Nice. <laughs> we're excited about this. Bottom line. Uh, I had to go with the good luck jersey because I didn't wear game five and we know what happened then. So uh, here we go. If you're coming down, enjoy it. It is going to be warm going in, going to be out, going to be warm inside. Let's get loud. Let's get rowdy. The Bucks were a bit cocky for good reason in game five. Let's uh, let's shut that down tonight. 630 uh, tip off here. So enjoy a uh, slight chance of something popping up. Uh, it is going to be a humid one too. We're already uh, in mid 60s for dew points with a temperature of 78 degrees. So this is definitely more of a mid summer feel to the air outside. Uh, this morning wasn't bad. Now the dew points are creeping back up and as a result, uh, we will keep in a slight chance of a pop up shower or thunderstorm. We're starting to see some clouds bubbling a little bit with the heating that's undergoing here. There's not a whole lot to lift the air other than the heat itself and sometimes that can do the trick here, especially when we're forecasting highs that will be in the mid in some cases upper 80s. So I also got the Indians in town tonight against the Bisons, a 635 first pitch dress comfortably with the heat. And then as we go into tomorrow, I want to show you future track 13. We're going to have plenty of rain around tomorrow morning. There will be some downpours embedded within some of this stuff as well. The coverage will diminish late afternoon and evening. However, whatever does pop up and it will be scattered, we'll have some bang for its buck because we're going to have a lot of moisture in the atmosphere. We expect there will still be some downpours uh, that will pop up with uh, the uh, muggy air on Friday afternoon. Now let's get into the weekend here. A little patchy fog around for mini marathon. We'll say slightly humid as the muggy meter will show dew points near the line of discomfort. OK, we've had much more humid first Saturdays in May. With all that said, it's going to be a little more of a humid running weather for you than you've been training for. So just know that it will have a little bit of impact on you there. Uh, some storms very late Saturday. We're talking after eight o'clock. So Rev Indy looks great mid 70s on Sunday and then we're going to keep it unsettled. We've got several rounds of uh, showers and storms ahead next week.